In today's video, we will find out if I can survive the chilly underwater depths of Subnautica Below Zero. Will I forever be trapped under the ice? Or will I end up as some Leviathan's new chew toy? Whatever may happen to me though, you must promise me one thing. Like, subscribe, and click that bell notification next to subscribe so that I may grow as a content creator and make better and more exciting videos in the future. I'm hoping this will be better than last time because this is a uh, entirely uh, story-based game. Go to hardcore. Oh, where's my any button? This is the farthest that I can take you on company space bucks, Robin. You sure you want this? The research is in everything. It is to me and Sam. I need to know what happened. Voice the actor, uh, then again, we are to talking to someone. <sighs> Gonna miss you, Robin. I'll find my way back. Approaching forty five, forty six feet. Surface temperatures. <laughs> Deployed. It is kind of a stupid idea to go behind a meteor when trying to land on a planet. Alright, let me out, let me out, let me out! Same wetsuit, though. Okay, let's see. What do I have? Why is this on pause? Is, is that an automatic thing? Is it an accessibility? PDA pause. There we go. Welcome to 4546 Enjoy your stay. Okay. I don't think the lifepod survived. Just a small hunch. Oh, don't want those. Oh, were they getting annoyed that people were saying acquired? This meteor stop better not kill me. Was there anything over here? There was wires and YouTube blocks. Alright, these plants help me stay warm because there's a cold meter. I should find a way into the water and get to the drop pod. And of course, Robin talks anyway through the game. To herself. The only way to stay warm in this game is to either be in the water or be next to one of those plants. Or be anywhere outside, inside. Which are very limited. Ribbon plants contain electrolytic materials that can be used in energy storage. And instead of a life pod, we have whatever this thing is. Down the drop pod. I want to offer my sincerest condolences on the passing of your sister. I got to know Sam better towards the end of my mandate with Altera on 4546. Electronics, battery. Where we were thrown together as basemates at Outpost Zero. She spoke often and fondly of you. Right, there's I my scanner. Know, it didn't sit right with me when Altera played Sam's death on negligence. The Samantha Ayu I met was many things. I can't scan myself, which, uh... Devoted to her work, but never is a negligent. Thing. 
I wish I could offer you something more substantial, but my I'm gonna make another battery. has been cut off. You may be in a better position to look into things than I am. If you're able to, Delta Station was our HQ. They were in a big hurry to leave. Okay, so I need silicon rubber. To be found there. It has a big radio tower. Impossible to miss. Which should be the, the same. Yeah, it's Lydia a different Bench. type of creek vine, but it's still the same. Well, Sam, I guess I might as well gather some tools and resources before starting my search. Hope that radio tower is as easy to spot as Lil said. Okay, and then next one. Robin, guess what? I got the job. I'm going to 4546B. Now I'll be able to improve the mechanical avian and no, amphibian don't need that. real world stress conditions. Or the coral bridge. Listen, I know your stance on Altera, but I just hope you're happy your sis is happy. I sure hope my sis is happy. I can't wait till we talk again. Oh, I wanted to ask you something. Can you watch my oh, Augie while I'm away? Oh, Jesus, my I oxygen. I can trust to look after my best little potato. <laughs> potato, listen. I tried, but that name is just not sticking. He's my little extra bite. I'll leave the starchy tubers and nicknames to you. Anyway, if you say yes, thanks, baby sis. Love you. As material. Supply cash nearby. Oh, there is. Oh, that's next to the uh, sea monkeys, which are the equivalent of stalkers, except they don't bite. Uh, it acts a lot like um, real life. Also, that's a sea monkey. The, of course, my first one's a titanium. Do you still have oxygen? Do I need to go back up? Nope, stop. Ow! Ow! No, 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 no. Let me out, let me out, let me out. Oh, fuck. No! Okay, so I may be wrong on the sea monkey pop because that that didn't seem like it. That seemed that seemed like uh, something else that I completely forgot about, and that hoop fish is dead. That's oh, can I? No, that's just a massive iceberg. Oh, here's the sea monkey. No, I'm. You cannot have my shit. Okay, so it steals shit. Um, unfortunate name on the sea monkey. Or hide the signals of your choice with your Xenoworks PDA. Now with surface support. Xenoworks. Oh, and we get. I forgot what his name. I I normally just call him Ned Flanders, but this guy's basically the main character of the. Uh, Sam's research group. Seek shelter. Four, five, four, six B to Robin. Come in, Robin. <laughs> Remember when we used to play old timey space explorer? This is kind of like that, but Ooh. it's even harder to communicate. <laughs> well, let's see. I got your last message. Altera is not, as you put it, all terrorizing me. Things are going well. My project has a new name. Say goodbye to the mechanical avian amphibian. And hello to spy penglings. We're training the bots to mimic the creatures. Check out the photo. And I think I'm kind of seeing someone. I know it's not like oh, congratulations. to find a date, let alone on a mostly uninhabited water planet. But actually, you know what? Forget I said anything. Yeah, it's it's probably not even a real thing, but anyway, um, I'm sorry to hear Xenoworks might be strapped in the revenue department. Sounds like they still have you busy Xeno working, though. Not oh, great. I know there's no way to guarantee an alien intelligence startup will succeed, but you've put so much into it. I hope they find a way to keep going. Okay, I'm gonna need you know something like a rebreather. Let's go down there. Work at a small place where you have control over your research. Or an oxygen tank. All right, I gotta go. Later, baby sis. Love you. Oh wait, I'm at zero. Oh, please no, please no. Oh my god. So I'll leave 
this message on. Hey, Robin, I, I got your Augie photo. Thanks so much for taking care of him, even though he's a cranky potato. Hey, the nickname actually fits that way. A cranky potato. I know he can be a handful, but I really appreciate it. I'm a bit worried about my other baby, the mission. One of my penglings found something, something big. But Altera is just like, nothing to see here. Honestly, kind of glad you can't answer so you can't, you know, rub it in my face. Go ahead, bask in the fact that you were a little bit right about them. My project is on the line. My job, my safety. Um, I heard about Xenoworks getting bought. I'm sorry. But at least you still have your job. Guess you're one of us now. Like it or not, welcome to the Altera family. I, I should probably go before I say something I regret. Love you. Keep your chin up. Eye on the alien prize. Hey, Robin. <sighs> I'm sorry, my last message was so awful. I've been under a lot of stress. I'm not sure what's going on with anything. Oh. I need water. I can't really talk about it either. Oh, and I'm definitely not dating anyone on this water planet. Oh. I don't know what I was thinking there. Have I told you how cold it is here? Get this. I can't even get my wash and go dry before the wind freezes the moisturizer in my hair. Wild, right? Well, anyway. I'm sure you're mad at me after what I said. But I, I could really use a friend. You're my sister. I love you. I'm sorry. Okay, on to the next message. Hey, Robin. I'm, I'm, really need to know. I'm afraid something terrible is going to happen. You were completely right about Altera, okay? You were right. I was wrong. And the cat should be called Potato. I admit it. <laughs> oh, new paper mm. as Sorry. well. Bad attempt at a joke. I, I just... I don't know what to do. Can't do that underwater. I guess I should just come out and say it at this point. I've said this much already. We found a frozen leviathan that's infected with Kara. Altera thinks they can use it for something. Weapons, uh -oh. experimental treatments... A whole range of things. But one end of the range is ugly, dangerous, but, but profitable, of course. What if it gets out while we're messing around with it? Or worse, what if it ends up a bioweapon in the wrong hands? I, I hope I'm overreacting, but I don't think I am. Anyway, message me back, please. Uh, there they are. Could really use a friend. You're my sister. I love you. Okay, so what I'm currently looking for now is those sparks uh, lead to a new type of structure uh, that old Terra left behind. I'm just hoping this is the correct one for what I want. I believe it is. So if you hang on, personal log. I was a little nervous about dropping into an unknown area, but luckily this biome seems to have an abundance of minerals I can use for tools and upgrades. I didn't want another situation like the Xantos Five. When Xenoworks dropped me off, there were barely any resources. I survived off the land for three months with just a knife, my lucky PDA, and some rope. I am still kind of proud of that, though. Oh no. I've become the caged animal. No! Oh. So, oh, there's possibly a seek light down here. If not, I'm just gonna have to look for the sea monkey areas. Find the O2 tanks. There is one. Nope, that's just a beacon. Right, 
anyway, that's gonna have to lead me to getting the O2 tank and re Reaver. I didn't even check my Fuck. I swear that drop pot changed. Okay, so you're not gonna give me my stuff. As much. Obviously, I get the standard O2. Adding additional blueprints to your data bank. And. Standard oxygen tank can be up now I need to, to well get. Fins, I guess. And sea glide. And start work on Sea Glide. I will find out what happened to you. I promise. I will say I do like that we're not using a radio Easy anymore. Is a personal transportation device. Don't need Use that. High speed free diving. Just need Buildings flashlight. Light and map. Also, I'm gonna do something heinous. Baby penguin, mine. You can release those, but you, you, you can keep at least one, as long as you're not doing anything bad to it. Oh. That sounds like a distress call. When you're only. Transmission of unknown origin. Source of transmission depth calculated at approximately 200 meters. My only form of training in Morse code has ever been SOS, and that was SOS. So somebody's clearly still alive on this planet. Definitely. Riley wasn't eaten last game. That didn't happen. No, 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 no. Nope, that's coming after me. Why would you even stay here at this point? Oh, there was a sea truck under here. Fun. Fred, I'm not blaming you, but what do you mean it's gone? Where did it go? You found some trouble somewhere in the deep twisty bridges and decided to jettison modules? Yeah, I had to jettison a module. I got free, went back for it, it was just gone. And you think someone stole it? Or something. I didn't lose it, that's for sure. I'm careful with my tools. I'm sure you are, but you have to admit, there have been a lot of sea truck accidents, and they're rather expensive. You want to follow me on a few runs tomorrow? See what it's like? Conditions are way harsher than anything I ever imagined. I don't know if you could really understand it from inside your base. That won't be necessary. Thanks for your time. I'll write it up as an accident. Yeah, you better. Red should not be getting paid to get fucking spooked by those things. So, is this a scandal? No. Nope. Still haven't got my beacon. There it is. This is a recorded message. Hello? If you can hear this, you're trespassing. If you know what's good for you, you'll get the hell out of here. 
Marguerite? Use beacons to mark traverse territory. Show or hide the signals of your choice with your Xenoworks PDA. Now with surface support. She died by Leviathan last game. Don't know how she's alive. Obviously, I've played this game before, so obviously I know what's going on. Playing it up for laughs. So that's where I came from. I just need to go up here. Normally I just go through the caves themselves. <coughs> Ow. Hmm, shrub nut. Have I actually no, I have done five. So good to know that if there's anything that I need here, there'll be something, including sulfur. I don't need to go through any crash fish anymore. No more dings for me. Oh well. Okay, so what's here? Mineral detector. I actually do need these. Okay, so it's in Emmanuel's special report. Don't like him at all. Too passive aggressive. Doesn't know what the fuck he's talking about most of the time. Therefore, I am clearly projecting. Whoa, that clearly wasn't a cutscene stop. You're out of bounds. I'm not with Altera. Then your position is doubly precarious. What do you mean? If you're telling the truth, you're out of your mind. If you're lying, there'll be hell to pay. Wait! Who are you? Stay off my land. Okay, so, yeah, that is Marguerite. Um, obviously, last game she was implied the to be dead by a... Has been traced as far as my technology will allow. She was implied it to be dead by... I'm far less alone on this planet than I had anticipated. Are we going to location uploaded to PDA? Are we going to stop talking? Thank you. Um anyway, she was implied to be dead by a Reaper Leviathan. Um It's a shame what happened to Riley. Sure hope nothing like that happens to Robin. Sure hope she, sure hope she doesn't drown, die by drowning as or anything. Whoops. Okay, so th this is technically inside. Um, I am getting heat from this building. Oh, I might want to take that map. I just put it up around. Wait, can I? I can use this map. Okay, so we're in Site Omega. 
A map will come in handy. I should be able to find my way to Phi Robotics where Sam worked. I... I've honestly never touched that map before. I... The, I'm gonna be honest, I thought it was a poster when I was scanning it. Well, before I was scanning it. For the last time, I'm not cheating. Then what's your theory? What's going on? If you ask me, Zeta's been blinking a lot. I think it's a tell. He does have a point there. It's allergies. Allergies? <laughs> oh, is something in bloom in this frozen sector? Thermal lilies, and if you gang up on me, I swear you're all fired. <laughs> you're not even my boss. Oh, you're all so gullible. You're fighting each other. Meanwhile, look at Parvin. <laughs> just look at him. What am I doing? I'm not doing anything. Let's just take this to a vote. All those who think Zeta's allergies are a bad case of alienitis, say intruder. Intruder. Uh, intruder. 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 Danny? Oh, I'm just an observer here. I'm going to use my pass. Is there some kind of scientist He's acting very sus. Zeta, Sam, Danielle, you three are suddenly very aligned. Or, like I said, Parvin is cheating. I'm starting to wish I was cheating. He's acting a little suspicious. Communications tower maintenance lock. Another day. Another slight by the winged furies. As usual, Can I, scan? I got an interference alert. As usual, I went out to see what the problem was. As usual, it was frozen stalagmites of feathered bird excrement. Be I hear the career impact of saying this officially. If you can even call what I have a career. We need to memorialize Fred Shaving Cat. targeting me personally. The week I was out with the flu. I came back to find the tower spotless. Parvin laughed at me when I asked him how he cleaned it. Silly me. As if Parvin would ever clean anything. There's nothing left for me to do but quit. But I know that's what the birds want me to do. Oh, and I got the tower up and running. Maintenance complete. Jenny, you wouldn't believe the adventure I'm having. It's just like when we were kids. We used to play underwater city. Only sea monsters aren't pretend, and I don't need to hide behind you when one swims by. Because I'm safe in my sea truck. Safe and very, very brave. Please tell Dad for me. Thanks so much for the mustache, kid. By the way, to be honest, I wasn't sure if it was a gag gift at first. Personal grooming is something of a challenge here, and as you know, I'm a pretty low-maintenance guy to begin with. But you'd be surprised how handy mustache wax is in an emergency. There have been some close scrapes. For a while there, someone was sabotaging my truck, and I thought I was seeing things. But my friend Sam helped me sort it out. Although, <laughs> she's had some troubles of her own lately. To be honest, I get a little worried out here sometimes. But I guess that's normal, under the circumstances. Gotta expect a little risk, right? I should be happy. I have great friends and a good paycheck. Anyway, love you, Jenny, and Dad. Please find a way to tell him that he won't find embarrassing. And don't worry, I'm looking for the perfect fish to bring back as a gift. Your favorite. <laughs> the mustache kit definitely wasn't a gag gift. <laughs> that man's mustache is the most glorious thing in the really entire universe. I didn't know she had it in her. Okay, this is a manual's desk. I don't want to hear what he has to say, but good morning, go on. Boss Pack. Just a quick update to inform you of some key achievements and priority shifts we need you all to get behind. The Spy Pangling Project was a resounding success. Please join me in congratulating Samantha IU, who is now reassigned to Outpost Zero, helping us. At least he's congratulating her. Congratulations are also in order for Danielle Valenti and her team at Omega Lab. The closing of Phi Robotics means important funds can be redirected to their Kara bacteria study, which has important, positive implications for the life sciences. Of course, he's the only one. You're all doing food? an exceptional job, and I don't want to promise anything, but HQ has Proper been food? taking notice. Keep up the good work, and I think 
think we can start discussing bonuses soon. Although the food on this planet does seem really that delicious. Means, you'll be happy to know the Frost Pack is making excellent progress. I must say, my management style appears to be uniquely well suited to isolated planets. I miss you, of course, but I wonder if you feel it too. As great as we are together, we're almost better apart. Just look at how well Prosperina did in her last show. I'm sorry I couldn't be there to see it, but I'm sure if I'd been around, I'd only have made her nervous. Once this mission is over, I'll come home for a few good months. And then, what do you think if we look at reorganizing our expectations to facilitate longer term separation success? I really think this could be a great model for us going forward, romantically and otherwise. Don't forget, I love you from the depths of my heart. Keep on succeeding in your projects. You know there's nothing I find more attractive. Debbie de deserves a better person than fucking Emmanuel. Tower maintenance log. Okay. This time the birds have really done it. I don't know what they've been eating, but it's corrosive when it comes out the other end. I'm gonna need to rewire. I'm short an element to fabricate the right cable. I remember seeing someone and did that dive to the old ship. I'm gonna go out there and see if I can get some more. That should fix it. Maintenance status, in progress. The birds have really had a grudge on it. Wait, there's no, there's nothing. Tower maintenance log. Okay, this time the birds have really done it. I don't know what they've been eating, but it's corrosive when it comes out the other end. There's literally nothing on the towel. I need to rewire. I'm short an element to fabricate the right cable. I remember seeing someone I did that dive to the old ship. I'm gonna go out there and see if I can get some more. That should fix it. Maintenance status in progress. Okay, so I need to go home, make an MVP. I don't think I could make that jump. I'm not going to try it. Alright, so once we're home, MVP, then find out what Sea Trek needs. Put on the penguin. Fred, great to see you. Come on in. You don't mind if I record this, do you? Uh, uh -oh. are you in trouble? <laughs> no. You know me. Just a fanatic for details. And my memory's not what it used to be. <laughs> I know what that's like. <laughs> yes. Is that why you've been running so many personal errands for your colleagues? We asked you to limit them. Uh, uh oh. I'm in trouble. That's not how I want you to look at it. Here's what I see. You're a team player. You want to get the job done. Uh, I think I have a pretty good record there. You want people to like you. Has anyone complained? Fred, the trouble is, not everyone is as reliable as you are. Sometimes people need help being where they need to be and concentrating on their work. He's being coerced. All work related. It appears you transported tech for Lil, rather far out from her base. Lil needed to go deep, and she needed a sea truck. Her work is currently on surface installations. She shouldn't be anywhere near the water. I, uh, well, I... No more favors to friends, agreed? Yes, sir. <laughs> ah, I keep telling you. Call me Manu. <laughs> Passive aggressive prick. <laughs> yes, it was. The damn ugly thing followed me into the shallows. Didn't think something that big would follow me up here. Had a jettison the sea truck. Again. Uh, I guess I could try to go back for the parts when it leaves. If it leaves. I really don't want to sit in another meeting with Emmanuel. Manu, as he likes to be called. Ugh, I just want to drive around and deliver cargo in peace.
I didn't... In my last playthrough, I didn't stop to look at the Seamoth or Cyclops. Well, no, I did stop to look at the Cyclops. But this... That's so much better to just look at. Uh, head in. Glad that didn't damage it. Oh yeah, this looks like a... Like an actual structure. Okay, so I remember this place. Very, very clearly. If you played this during the beta, you'd probably understand what this is as well. Or saw anything on the beta. But this is where the story initially started out at. Yeah, let's just open this first. Oh, did it start hailing already? Nope, never mind, it's fun. I'm staying in here. Motivational posters were banned from Xenoworks following a lengthy discussion at the annual company retreat three years ago. This poster is technically Why? contraband. What the fuck? So that's the task list. This game is just trying to get under my skin now. If only this base still had power. This is Lillian's place. Is Sam's space? And Sam's. What is she doing all the way out here? Oh, no time I'm back. I have a choice. I have to neutralize the bacteria myself. Oh, look, it's potato. I'm a little nervous. Okay, terrified. But this thing is a death sentence. We shouldn't be messing around with it. I'm no biologist, I know. So does everyone else here. I haven't spoken to Danny since we fought about it. Zeta said she'd handle it and then didn't. Oh, oh. Lil practically begged me to drop it. This is completely beyond the scope of your work. You have to stop before you jeopardize your standing with the company. I don't want good standing with a transgub that would do this. Robin tried to warn me. Maybe she was right, and Altera really is unfixable. Maybe I deserve better than this. We all do. I've synthesized the antibacterial agent. <laughs> I know my biochem at least well enough to do that much. I've stashed some away in one of the Pengling research caves, southeast of the Leviathan. That was probably the easy part. Now I just have to carry out the plan. Focus. Be brave. Worry about what happens next, after the threat is neutralized. They're going to know it was me. If they send me home, what? When they send me home, where the ice isn't 20 feet thick, I can get my Augie bun back. We can cuddle under a nice warm blanket. Things with Robin will thaw out. They always do. Besides, I think she'll respect this. And then, maybe I'll start my own research outfit with an awesome team. 
I'd love to work on prosthetics again. Oh, potato. I miss that fluffy little couch walrus. Okay, at least... At least we figured uh, out what the fuck has been happening. Svea and Oren, I'm counting the days until I can come home and give you all the hugs and kisses. Since my research project was cancelled, they At least we know what Fred's been doing. doing. Nothing much. Just was she right? Could there be architects living on this planet? Altera really messed up if they got that one wrong. Thanks for stopping the game for that. Signal Not stopping the video if you Oh, control room. Our hands are a little bit too small for that. Oh, my darlings, Brian, Svea, and Oren, I'm counting the days until I can come home and give you all the hugs and kisses. Since my research project was cancelled, they have me at a place called Outpost Zero doing nothing much. Just cataloging things, plants, the occasional animal, but it's mostly ice where I am, so there's not a lot of new stuff to find. Svea and Oren, you know how you get bored when your hover dance teacher makes you practice skills 15 minutes over schedule and it eats up your freestyle time? It's a bit like that. But I have a new roommate, Samantha, a roboticist. You should see her little bangling box. Oren, you'd love them. But she got management upset. I guess this is just where they send you if they decide you're too much trouble. I'm kind of glad she's here, though. I was getting lonely. <laughs> I'm still trying quietly. I don't want any more trouble to figure out where I went wrong. I was sure. I picked up a distress signal. I, I was right on top of it, and then it just stopped. What if someone, an architect, is still down there and, and needs help? I'll be home before I ever get to find out, and it will fall to some future researcher to come and find out, I guess. I, I hope. But oh, I can't wait to be home with you. When are you going to send me some more art? There's still a patch of bare wall here that could use some colour and a touch of genius. I miss you. I love you. I hope you're still proud of me. I'm proud of you. At least Altara has taste in art. Uh, next one. What is... No. Hey, Sam. You want to say hi to my kids? I told them I'd show them a day in the life of a scientist. <laughs> of course. Hi, Oren. Hi, Svea. Tell us what you're working on. Oh, um... This is a personal project. Looks more like biology than robotics. Yeah, I was just thinking... I know no one is on my side with this, but what if I just found a way to take care of the deadly bacterium? I, uh, I wouldn't say no one is on your side. I'm on your side. I know, but you won't say anything to Emmanuel or Zeta, anyone. What effect would it have if I did? I'm not exactly employee of the month right now. I know. I wouldn't want you to risk more than you already have. I'm sorry. I wish I could do more. What? What are you working on there? And what do you mean by take care of the deadly bacterium? Uh, is that thing still recording? Oh, right. Uh, <laughs> so, that was Sam, kids. I'll turn this off now. Maybe you should edit that before you, uh, publish it. Don't want to make you hit worry teams about you. have been pursuing more nebulous approaches to awakening the architects. I've tried to take a more practical approach. We know these part organic, part digital beings stored what they thought of as themselves on computers within their sanctuaries. And we know efforts to wake or communicate with them have been in vain. My theory is that to make first contact, these digital ghosts must first be recombined with an organic component. As Dr. Kaz Slaney's classic study noted, we know they had means to grow cybernetic bodies and to transfer their data patterns between them. 
There is a known probable architect sanctuary in this sector, but entry is not currently possible. If I can get inside and present the right vessel, I do think we will be successful. Okay, there's got to be some way of getting in there. Just not a clue how. Is the other log a... No, it isn't. Okay. All right, moving on. Gonna get back in one more time, then back out. Yeah, so this is the SOS. Took me a second to get in here. Just a second. I don't believe we have traps here. Hello? Is someone there? Hidden man rock speaking. We're running out of time. What is I wonder what he means by a manner of speaking. I can help you better if you show yourself. If we could show ourselves, we would not need storage. You mean you don't have a physical presence? Are you one of them? An architect? Storage medium identified. We will be lost unless we find a new host. Can you help? Can you use my PDA for storage? You are not with the group from before. Your cybernetic components bear their signal. Altera? No, my equipment is, uh, borrowed. It will have to do. How long have you been stored here? Longer than that. Warning. Sanctuary power. Critical. Oh, shit, well, we... Our data can be downloaded from the terminal. We may speak more once the transfer is complete. How do I equip the, uh, yes, PDA okay. terminal again? Three. Again? Oh, I don't. I have to use a cutscene. Storage medium accepted. Brace for transfer. Brace? Ah! Ah! What's happening? Transfer. Ah! Oh! Transfer complete. Oh. How do you feel? Why do you sound like you're inside my head? The facility identified hospitable capacity within your cerebral cortex. You are in my head? I offered you my PDA! Get out! Oh no. Does your kind perceive a boundary between cybernetic and organic components? My mind is not a component! You sound angry. We will allow you a moment to process. Don't you go silent on me. Hello? I didn't think, uh, emotion was in the architects, uh... That's the explanation. Okay, everybody. So how does he know that Robin's angry? Go on. I understand this arrangement is undesirable to you. You're not real. Go away. It's Go real. It obviously, it's real. Transfer. Why do you keep saying we? How many of you are there? One of us and all of us. We do not think of ourselves as individual, distinct. Why don't you start by telling me who you are? You may append your seed code to my species designation. Please call me Al. 
My whole life I've been dying to meet a sapient space-fearing alien up close, and you're telling me your name is Alan? Is it insufficient? No, it's fine. Perfect. Where are you from, Alan? Your kind calls us a pocket dentist. A precursor race? But what are you doing here? That is a long story. Perhaps you would prefer to focus on the construction of a new storage medium to which I may transfer. Yes. Fine, absolutely. How do we get you out of my head? I have added the information to your data bank. You will need to find the necessary components. Any idea where I can find uh -oh. them? Uh-oh. It is unclear. I have been disconnected from my network for so long I cannot locate the core reference. <sighs> He's actually become the PDA. Oh no. If he starts using Aquite, I'm not going to be happy. The sea truck is nothing like the Seamoth. The Seamoth is an enjoyable ride. Through and through. You don't have any modules on it, but... You don't need it when it's, a, when it's just for a smooth ride. With this, this is the only vehicle in the sea. Not even the Cyclops is allowed in the game anymore. Because of how versatile this was. <coughs> okay, Ruby. I've never seen this rock rock before. Can I eat it? Useless fucking crow. Useless. Never want to see its face ever again. I wonder what the feather, tish, the feather fish tastes like. Probably like feathers. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Ooh, sea duck. Yeah, that's the sea duck, not sea truck. Oh, and of course there's diamonds here. Oh, 14 oxygen. Oh, fuck. New blueprint synthesized. Why am I holding my breath? IRL. Anything on the roof? Nope. Okay, time to head down. I believe this is extremely tight, though. Okay, so grab you. That's a stupid idea, but I'm going to have to go back up. Shouldn't have gone for the thermal plant. Ah, fuck. That oxygen plant better be open. It does. Need to get back to the sea truck, though. I'm gonna wait five seconds. <laughs> that plant better be up. It is. Okay, head down immediately. Oh, there's another thermal plant. Oh, it had to be extremely tempting, didn't it? Okay, there's an oxygen plant here. Uh, actually, if it's there, I can get to it in time.
after scanning that. Uh, that, sh that isn't it, but... Best I could do. I'm gonna go to the other one quickly. Quickly! This one better open. Open up. And thus ends Robin, and subsequently the end of my Subnautica Below Zero run. Well, that's what I would like to say. Yeah, I wasn't satisfied with my death either. I hardly got anywhere, and the game's a story-based game, so I went and played the game in survival on stream. Um, actually, on today's recording, uh... It'll be the last stream. Uh, so I'm going to be uploading those fully unedited uh, VODs straight to the channel. Uh, if you'd like this video and would like to see more, please don't forget to also subscribe and click that bell notification. And if you would like to catch more of my new and developing content, please also go over to my Twitch and follow me there. Uh, but for more content like this, um, here's a sneak peek for my next stream. I'm willing to take full responsibility for the horrible events of the last 24 hours, but you must understand our interest in their world was purely for the...